What is going on? Hope you guys are doing absolutely fantastic. I'm out here once again joined by my good buddy Justin. He's over there throwing a line in. We're out here to do a little bit of mid-winter pike fishing. That is the main targeted species today. We're gonna fool around maybe with some other fish if we find them, but the main goal is to get on some northerns. So I got a bunch of lures with me, a bunch of different stuff to try, and we're just gonna fool around and see if we can make it happen. Generally, I'm not fishing open water this time of year. Everything's normally iced over, but not quite iced over enough for ice fishing. So this is generally a really tough time of year. But strangely enough, this year, a day in the 40s is pretty common. So we're gonna roll with what we got. It's a beautiful day. It's not too unbearably cold. And we're already seeing bait fish around. And we got a beautiful open lake. So we're just gonna see what we can do. All right, I'm starting off with a Rapala Husky Jerk in uh, Glass Clown. We're just gonna twitch it through here, see what's up. There's just so much bait in here. Like it's ridiculously thick. I mean, I'm not gonna be surprised if we reel in a snag bluegill. That's just how thick they are in this place. Yup, okay, that just happened. Sorry, bud. Really didn't mean it. Get them popped off. So they're in there. And where there's bait, there's generally larger fish nearby to chow down. What is this? Oh my gosh. Sorry. My apologies again, fish. different tails too. I was seeing a minnow presentation. Might pick up a crappie. I don't know. Once again, wait, hang on. That feels like it might be bigger. No. Oh my gosh. It is bigger, but he's not. He didn't eat it. Oh gosh. It's a bass. No, it's a crappie. It's a big crappie. All right. Hey. Hey, pal. Man, I don't want to be snagging fish all day. Come on now. That's an absolutely beautiful crappie. I'm not going to take him out of the water. He doesn't need that extra stress when he's dealing with the cold, especially if he's not fairly hooked. But man, um, that was a beautiful crappie, seriously. I want a crappie fish now. <laughs> all right, I went over to the other side. Justin's going to see if he can get on some of those crappie with an ultralight setup but I just saw something kind of come to the surface over here. So I'm gonna cast around on this side. See if we can get something to actually eat this thing. Oh my gosh, he's on. What'd you get? Oh my gosh. Got a crappie. All right, Justin has landed three absolute slab crappies. So we're gonna do a little bit of follow the leader here. And I got a super simple slip float rig like he's got tied on. He's using a chunk of night crawler. I'm gonna see if I can get one to eat a little plastic, but it's just a jig and then a slip float above it. No peg at all. So it slides freely. And I did something a little bit different than he did as well where I added the stopper just so my jig doesn't get caught when I'm casting to make sure it really falls smoothly. Not necessary because he's getting it done with what he's got, but just uh, a couple little things I've changed up to see what I can do with this same setup.
Oh, I just got eaten. There he is. Oh, yeah. Let's go. Not quite as big as some of the ones Justin's been pulling out of here, but let me get a hand on him. Hey, buddy. Give me your face. Okay, there we go. Nice, clean little black crappie right there. First fish of the day. That's awesome. Or for me at least, but man, that's so cool. Look at that fin display. Absolutely beautiful fish. Not gonna keep them long, gonna get a picture and send them out there. Beautiful. All right. There you go, pal. Good stuff, man. Real good stuff. Yeah. What? You're gonna have to give me some. Just Dude. pound it. It's too cold for you, man. Dude, that is sick. What, what color are you using? Uh, I'm using silverfish. Nice. So, unfortunately, you can't buy these anymore. Otherwise, I would recommend them. But uh, I'm using a silver little straight tail. And uh, anything like that is probably close enough. Way out. Far out, man. Far out. Something came up and hit the float. I know. I'm a Dude. I think it was a crappie too. A crappie literally had a like you saw it. Yeah, I saw it. Like it Oh my god. Coming up and surfacing. So the crappie are obviously feeding upwards, that's what they normally do. Like, they're even coming out of the water for our float, which is weird as heck. So I'm just going to move this thing along. And see if they come up for a faster retrieve. Not much faster, but even less slack in my line. Dude, that was a hit, I think. Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! Did you see that? That was like the most giant crappie ever and he just had the float in his mouth. He had it in his jowls. Oh my gosh. That was just ridiculous. Holy crap. Oh, I just got a hit there. Dude, that was just a nonchalant eat, dude. That was crazy. That's a bigger fish. Oh no, about the same size. Never mind. They're hitting it though. They're so hitting that. Oh, I'm not. I'm not falling in the water. I'm just trying to get low. Dude, that's just another beautiful crappie right there. Hooked on the top of the mouth, right where you want them. That's fantastic. All right, pal. Let's get you back in the game, big dog. I'm working it with a tighter line because I noticed they're a little bit more aggressive and they'll get hooked better. 
And obviously I can feel it. Like, even when you find the fish, there's still stuff to figure out. Yeah, like, exactly. Like, we're catching fish, but we could be catching probably more and getting more eats, but we need to figure out exactly what they're looking for. So, still trying new stuff. Just little deviations from what's working for us. Okay, that was another eat, I think. Yeah. He doesn't even realize what's going on yet. I mean, they're also super sluggish from the cold, but I mean, that's a, that's a big fish right there. Dude. Stay out of the way of this hog. <laughs> this hog. Trying not to de-slime them so much, especially in this cold. Got to take good care of them. But man, oh my gosh, that is just a killer fish right there. Hooked right on the schnoz. That came out like nothing. Dude, what a beautiful fish. All right, he's ready to go. Give him a little flick out there. He'll kick off, yep. I, I think I actually have like a chartreuse or an orange jig tail, like a big one, like the size of the float. I might try that in a second here. gosh dude dude it's just it's just dead weight dude and huge wide head shakes that is like one of my favorite things about the crappie oh my gosh that's really good that's really really good man There's another one of those beautiful black crappie, man. Dude, the BBC. Back in you go. Oh, sorry, blog. I just kind of cast it over top of you. I will say, you are getting way farther than me right now. Oh my, dude, you might want to reel in, dude. Yeah. Oh my goodness. That might, that might be the, uh, that's three casts in a row. That might be the bigger two of them cast. I mean, it's just what always amazes me with crappie is they just move so much water. It's ridiculous. Like, that's crazy, man. Oh my gosh. Look at that chunk. And look how, look how thick that thing is across the back. I mean, that's just, that's just unreal. Oh man, dude. Thank you, Lord. That is just unreal. Beautiful double up, man. Awesome. Absolutely Sweet. awesome. All right, we'll send him back. Oh, hey, what are you doing? <laughs> All right, okay. Uh, They'll take their time. Now, if our hands weren't about to fall off, we would definitely have an epic handshake after this. What are you talking about, dude? Put Whoa. it there. Oh, and it's still a crisp down. Let's go. All right, actually, I think we're going to take a break there have a snack, warm up in the car, and then come back out here, try to catch a few more. That's crazy. What? This is doing better than the Yeah, is that nuts? It didn't start out that way though. No? We had to figure out how to fish it. Oh my gosh. Dude, there is, there is a school out there, and if you put it on the school, they just eat it. Yep. It's just gone. Feels like it's gonna be another good one. I don't know, 
Sometimes it's hard to tell just because crappie displace so much water. Like, they can just feel enormous, dude. Like, honestly, that's probably like average for the day. But average. that thing felt giant. That is the average for the day. Like that is, that's a good day of fishing, man. That's a real good day of fishing. That's just really good. And then the fin display they've been giving us is just, I'm very grateful for that. That's just good for our enjoyment, right? That's a big one, isn't it? That is the big one. Let's just admire Justin's oh. fish for a second. Woo. Like, dude, dude, that thing's bigger than both of my hands together. Like, we've seen how thick the bluegill are. I can't imagine how thick the crappie are out there. That was a hit right there. I saw that one. Oh my gosh, he's actually running. This might actually be the biggest one. I thought, oh my gosh, dude, he's not even. No. Okay, okay, okay. Stay pinned, brother. Please stay pinned. Oh my gosh, dude, what is even on here? Okay, hang on. He's moving in. He's moving in. He's moving in. He's moving in. Be very, very gentle. I just, I, I, step one is just seeing what this thing is. Because I have not had a fish move like that all day. I'm slowly bringing him in. Do not throw that. Oh my goodness. Please, Lord, please. Keep the tension on him and just slowly work him in. Oh my gosh. Okay. Okay, okay. Well, he's, he's moving in, but as soon as he lays eyes on me, he's probably gonna freak again. Okay, 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 okay. What do we got going on here? Oh my gosh. Real gentle like, okay? Okay. He's moving in a little bit. This is whack. Actually madness. Gloves are coming off, dude. I need all feel on this fish, man. Okay. Oh my goodness, okay. He's so, he's holding so tightly, dude. Like, he's hardly moving in. He's just barely drifting towards us. Like, I gotta get him turned in here, but now he's just dead weight. I think that could be a catfish, do you? I don't know what on earth this is. It's a pike. Oh. It's a pike, dude. It's a pike. Oh my God. Okay, now we know it's a pike. So obviously I'm super stoked. We'll see if we can get him in. I've got him in on ice fishing gear before through the ice. We'll see if we can get him in here. Lord, please. Lord, please, oh my gosh. Let's get low on him. Let's try not to spook him. 
because that can be the killer when you get them in close. When you get them in close, they make eye contact with you and you're, they're just like, oh, heck nah. Now, he's hooked very precariously, but we might be able to make this happen here. We've made it this far, right? Oh, that hook set is freaking me out, but. Oh my gosh, we got him. Okay, so I guess we are pike fishing today. I had no idea this dude was gonna come out last second there. Oh my gosh, that's a beautiful pike right there. Like, this is above average for me. Generally around here we get these little snot rockets. This is a healthy, healthy fish, man. Like, look at that gut on that guy. He's been eating good and you know it, and I know it too. Oh my gosh, just a beautiful fish, man. Oh, love it. That is killer. That is a very appreciable fish. Oh my goodness, thank you, Lord. Hooked beautifully right in the skin of the lip. Can't really ask for anything better than that when you're fishing with light stuff. Can you hook one of these guys? Get him unwrapped here. Let's send him on his way. Oh, he's ready to go for sure. Man, oh my goodness. That is so good, man. That is so good. Oh my gosh, come here, camera. Let's do it. Yeah. Oh yeah, that was uncomfortable. All right, we're totally ending it there. That was just a ridiculously good afternoon of fishing with my man over here. Like, it just doesn't get much better than that in the dead of winter. And uh, that's this is my first day of fishing in the new year. So happy new year to you if you see this. Uh, well, I mean, it'll probably be a while since, until I get this up from the time that I'm filming it. But, you know, happy new year. And uh, I really, really appreciate you guys watching. I hope you guys enjoyed as much as I did. And uh, yeah, good thing I won't have to change the uh, intro because we caught a putt. <laughs> Anyways, once again, I appreciate you guys. I'll see you in the next one. Peace out. Dude, that dab hurt. <laughs> that hurt so bad. Dude, are you kidding me? What a blessed day of fishing.